Hi YouTube. Um, this is Jaslyn. I'm back. <laughs> um, I told y'all last time that we were going to start having some discussions, and so we're back <laughs> with some of my college buddies to have a discussion. Um, Hi, I'm Neva. Hey, never. how you doing? <laughs> Yay, you know. Okay. <laughs> my major is psychology. Professional. I want to get my doctor's degree, so hey. Okay. Guys, hit me up. Here is the topic today. Losing loved ones. Hmm. We lose loved ones all the time. We lose them to death. We lose them to breakups. We lose them to mess and lies. We lose them all kind of ways. And we just want to pinpoint all types of ways because we've all been <laughs> hurt <laughs> and... <laughs> We've all been hurt, and we've all been oh, affected by losing, losing. This is your personal yes. experience. I have yes, personal experience. Like I said, everyone has been affected by losing a loved one. Okay. First of all, we're going to talk about grief and how to handle losing a loved one, and this is a very serious topic. First of all, when it first happens. I understand that we go through a stage of depression. depression. Sometimes I think the first stage would be shock, basically. I cannot believe this just happened. You know, um, why? Denial, I believe, is another thing. No, I cannot believe this just happened. It did not happen. No, that's not her. That's not him. This is a very serious topic today. I think you're the only one following. <laughs> <laughs> so, this is, is, is something that really doesn't take years to get over. It's something that you can control your own healing process. I don't think someone can tell you, okay, it's time for you to stop grieving over this. Or it's time for you to stop feeling like this. I think that's with everything. With breakups, with friendships. No one can tell you when to stop caring for caring for that person Appreciate because you that. have a heart. <laughs> you have a, a hole in your heart for that person. Appreciate and as long as that yes. hole is there, as long as it's not healed, you have all the time you need to grieve. But sometimes it can be a girl that breaks a boy's heart. It can so be, yeah. That. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And when a girl breaks a boy's heart, boys, don't feel bad. Don't act like you can't cry or you can't feel bad. You you have a heart too. Yeah, y'all trying to be hard. Yeah, so. it's you know it's really not this serious. It's you not. Know, everybody got a soft side. It's not. It's okay. Especially if it's somebody you love. Okay, I understand that if a girl hurts somebody that loved her a lot, he has he has that he he can be mad. Hold on. Oh oh oh. And if a girl breaks your heart. Don't take it out on all the rest of the girls. Exactly. Don't do that. Don't. The rest of you females, if somebody oh, yes. hurts you, yes. do not take it out on the next in my person own because they may be good. In my own experience, if I broke somebody's heart, okay, and I've done it, and I, I've messed up, I secretly, deep down in my heart, hit it behind the box of all my childhood memories, I want that person to be happy with the next person. that he, I don't want him sitting there taking it out on every other girl because there's girls out there sitting there who's been hurt by other boys wanting somebody to come rescue them. Mm -hmm. They can't find that rescuer, rescuer if you sitting there being bitter over someone who don't even care about you no more. Don't even care. Don't even care. You know? You know what I'm saying? It just, it don't work like that. Okay, we're going to go to the phone. We have a phone caller right now. We have a now. caller. What's your name? What's your name? Hello, what's my name? Yes, hello, what's your name? My name is Bucky. Bucky, what's your name? Hello, Bucky. Hello, what's your name? What's your name? Hello, Bucky. 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 Hello, Bucky.
um, love will get you killed. That is what I'm saying about the uh, the bitterness views. Don't don't have that mentality because love. Mm, okay, love can really <laughs> love can really be a a beautiful thing yes. if you find it with the right person. But first of all, you really too young to be. You really are. You in well, your no, 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 you in your no. You never can Come be too young. Be faithful. It's like, like, okay, but you have some people who have found their boyfriend friend in fourth and fifth grade but they haven't they didn't start loving each other but they you know was just playing elementary sometimes it comes to the point where you got to come back you go away and you come back to this person you well, know what i mean i feel that hey the feel? only way that you can settle down as you get older because in your promise you can't settle down right i now. know people who've been together for 50 years and they've been together since Okay, fifth grade. Okay, yeah, they can. But look, I bet if you ask them how many times they cheat, they yeah, that they yeah, tell you a lot. There's problems. There are problems. And that's the main reason why I said they had to go apart before they came back together. But the thing is, they still found but, love. But okay, and I know. Mm -hmm. But look, the reason why. But you know what? The reason why they cheated so much is because they found love while they were young. I believe finding love when you're young, it, it makes it better. You're not regret regretful. You're not, you know, so bitter hearted. Because I know sometimes when I go through bad relationships, I get bitter. I mean, I think that's just a, a, a real, just something that happens to people. You get bitter. You start to hate relationships. I remember I went through a breakup and I started to hate one of my closest friends' relationships. I, I just didn't like it. I, I hated to see them in love and me not be in love no more. It's just something that happens. <laughs> and you realize, you realize, you know, that's stupid. Don't hate on somebody else's relationship because your stuff going wrong. You know, but, you don't do that. But you know, you can also... <laughs> what? Caller? 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 Why would you hate on that relationship anyway? Because you get bitter. Because you, you remember the times where you was just as happy. And now you sitting there, you know, just looking sad hearted and you still see them happy and you it, it, it just hurts. You know what I mean? She answered that You know what I mean? Okay, but Jasmine. That's when I take like your quote that it kills love kills because it kills your soul. You know what I mean? You feel hurt. Hurt deep down. But Jasmine, I feel that you should meet somebody, settle down when you get older because he he already old. What can you possibly lose? <laughs> but see, you don't want that. You want that mentality. What could I possibly lose? I'm going to date this old geezer, and I'm going to see what happens. Okay, if you old, he old, you both old. I don't want that. Okay, we don't got dark. Okay, the caller. What is he saying? Okay, repeat that, caller. I said the way you said you like saying, I'm somebody older than your age. <laughs> Wait, I'm sorry, Colin. We had a technical difficulty. <laughs> okay, repeat that, Colin. Okay. Okay, can you repeat that? Oh yeah, right, right. Okay, so you saying wait till I get older to find love. That's you what tell, I mean. You too. tell me when does age define love? When does that tell me when my love is gonna be more beneficial than it would be when I'm young? You tell me that. You asking me? Oh, that's collar. Yes, collar. That's the question for you, audience. You tell us when is it beneficial. For us to find love, when we old or when we young, who tells us what age is when we need to find love? Hmm. Um, my, 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 I choose my mind first because, um, you know what I'm saying, I'm be old. And I ain't going to be really looking for nothing right now. You so won't be able to find nothing because love, you don't find love, love finds you, okay? That's what all love it. it finds you. You saying you gonna wait till you older, but what happened when you see this little fine shorty? She don't, you don't even think you gonna find in love with her. I mean, you just see her on Walmart. She bagging your groceries and stuff, and then <laughs> something happened to where you see her again, and then you just fall in love. Like you just can't control it. You be like, dang, I remember when I said I was gonna fall in love till I was old. See? Oh, what happened if? You fall in love with them. Oh, that's when you gonna go back to that love kill stuff. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's why yeah. we say. That's why we say. Wait. Wait. Sometimes. You both old. Oh snap. Oh, okay.
Well, that's it, YouTube. Our next segment oh. will be about we will be about excuse me. Why do people cheat? Yes. Why? Hey, why you know, do people cheat? Oh, he wanna be on this <laughs> Just hit us up, call us, hit us up, send us messages. You comments. know where to reach us. Yeah. Yeah. Right. You know.